Hi there, it's Tara. Okay, real quick, I just wanted to show you how to use a few of the features that you're going to be getting um, with this client portal um, from the MLS. It's basically like a back door to the MLS, so keep that in mind. You're going to receive an invitation that looks something like this with a link down below that says View Listings. And when you click it, it's going to open you up to something that looks like this. And you'll always have this top header here. And if you ever get lost or anything, just go back to click My Listings and you'll come back to this main site. So just the basics of it, I won't tell, teach you everything, but um, you're going to always see new homes. Uh, that match your criteria or ones that reduced prices will come to the newly matched tab and so then you can scroll down from here if you want to look at the detailed information on a home it's always right below on the gray bar here so you can view details by clicking here it's going to give you everything that um, that for the public record of it and uh, that uh, you guys are allowed to see and then you've got 22 pictures on this one you can click through them this way you can make them bigger and click through them this way just by clicking on the actual photo. Or you can go to map from here, okay, and then zoom in and out on the roller on your, on your mouse. Um, the other thing that's really nice to do, and I always encourage it, is to go bird's eye view on the house that you're interested in. So you can see what the neighborhood is like around it, if there's like a railroad track behind it. It's always a smart idea. If bird's eye view doesn't give you a clear enough picture, you can always scoot over to aerial and then zoom in. So that's another way to do it, okay? And then, of course, all your detailed information, heating, taxes, all of that are down below here. Now, the other thing that's really helpful, especially when we're collaborating on seeing what's good, what's bad, you know, even though this looks like a really nice house, if I was to save it, um, I just click up here and save it. If I didn't like it, I'd reject it. And then if you want to see it or you have additional questions, just press on post comment and say uh, is this a short sale okay um, that's a good question okay so you can put that in there and this goes directly to me so that I can answer those questions for you right away so feel free to do that or you can say okay we're gonna save this one then when it goes to your saved box so you can go back out to the main page by going close detail up here Okay, and then you're going to not see it on this main page anymore. It's going to be over in your saved box. Okay, so once you have a few saved, it would be then smart for us to go and take a tour through them. That way I really get a feel for what you see when you look at a house, how you feel about it, what you like, what you don't like, that kind of thing. It's really going to be helpful, especially when you get um, a lot of results coming in, like as this one has 66 results. Those are quite a few homes to look at. And um, it just means I need to narrow down exactly what it is that you are absolutely loving about a house and what you absolutely want. Uh, big yard, small yard, whether it is that you want it to be, um, you know, have a garage or you don't care if it has a garage, this type of thing. And then do you need like a family room and a living room or just one or the other? So anyway, those are all the questions that um, come along with going ahead and walking through homes together. All right, I will, if you have any other questions, please let me know. Other than that, I'll keep an eye on your client portal, so they, so they call it, and uh, we'll see what comes up, and then we'll go take a look. Thanks so much. Enjoy. Happy